product under review is the Romel Wonder Lash. Thanks for stopping by. I'm Roana, and if you'd like to hear my review on this product, please continue watching. Purchase this mascara about two to three months ago at uh, I think it was Ulta at Ulta and I paid I think it was like $8.99 US for it and they had a $1 off because they were introducing it so I think I got it for like $7.99 which is like $8. I was intrigued just because it said one lash mascara with argan oil a mascara with argan oil so I was like okay everything is argan oil is argan oil in your body lotions shampoo conditioner um, the oil itself you put it in your hair argan oil is taking over and I think we have um, Josie Mary and argan oil for your face and there are other brands now with argan oil for your face so I was like lashes argan oil and lashes really was intrigued had to try it out and let me tell you what my take is now that I have used it for a month. The package actually caught my eye and I wondered why it was more or less in the price range of Maybelline and L'Oreal mascaras when generally Rommel mascaras are around 5 US. It said here, and I picked up black by the way, it said clump free volume and definition. It's like clump free, better than the clump pressure. I actually love the clump crusher have a review on it have not used it after the first one but I have a double pack I actually purchased a double pack from Target when I was on vacation some time back and I have them still never used because I have a ton load so the packaging in itself is actually very sleek and nice I absolutely love it it's just different I'm a sucker for brown chocolate looking things generally I love um, this color in itself it's just like a copper with a brown mix up together right in it's in black very sleek packaging I noticed when I pulled out the wand it comes out with some extra product that is at the end as you can see you will definitely need to dip um, put it back in the tube and take it off because that excess is going to have your eyes um, looking all messed up the bristle is actually plastic, which generally has a flexible feel to it, but the wand itself in total is not flexible, just where the bristles are for application. I find that it's very easy to apply on your eyes, as you're going to see in the demonstration here. It's really nice to um, apply. The first layer seems to just give a little length, give a little volume and more or less coat the lash. The second application now you're going to see that you're getting the volume and the length and your lashes are beginning to look more defined, voluminous and really nice. Now here I have actually just more or less two coats and if I turn sideways you can actually see it here. I have Asian stubby lashes so this for me is really nice for an everyday mascara that can provide this look for me I am extremely happy now for the price it was I thought okay maybe I should have gotten a little more length because you know just thinking that but it does not really say length it just says volume and definition so I'm gonna go through the claims tell you how well it will you know if it worked for me that way and then tell you my overall take formula formula with argan oil um, smoothens lashes with zero clump feather light volume I got the more I use this as it's starting to um, maybe halfway through it or a third way through it I'm noticed that I really do have to if I just put it on quick quick no, I have to take my time and comb through my lashes and I actually do get that clump free. And yes, it does feel feather light on my lashes. The lashes feel conditioned, soft and flexible. They do feel flexible. They do feel soft. I don't feel like if, you know, they're very bristle and hard. The smooth operator brush with ultra soft bristles hugs lashes, defining them from root to tip. That is absolutely true. Again, I love the other lash accelerator I think that was what the other review I did on the other Rommel mascara a couple days ago 
that mascara I love that bristles and I even love this bristle too I would not be throwing away these I may use them in other mascaras and see how well they work the result or lashes revealed with full smooth perfectly smooth clump free volume and yes I do feel that my lashes feel nice. It has a nice feel to it. I can't maybe put all of it into words, but I'm very happy. I feel comfortable wearing this mascara. It's not one of those that make your lashes feel crunchy. It says do, not, do always treat applicator with the same sanitary care you give your eyes. Reserve it for personal use. Close cap tightly after each use. Do not dilute mascara with any additive. So definitely cannot be treated and seal, you know, in those things in here. Do not use eye cosmetic if your eye is irritated injured or infected and consult your doctor in case of eye injury so really like this this is one that I can actually use on its own and I'm okay with it for everyday use I have been teaming it up with my other Ramel uh, mascara but I can use two coats of this and it, it's um, I'm happy with it it does not make my lashes fall out now I've been using a combination with this mascara so I think that this mascara is doing good to my lashes in a sense that I'm not seeing lashes um, on my cotton pad there are mascaras that I use even when I use them in combos that I actually see m my lashes when I take off at least one lash comes off every night yes it's that crazy mascaras do that to me but I've noticed with this and the other Ramel mascara that really and truly I'm not seeing it. I will see like a lash every couple days. So I'm really, really happy with the using both mascaras. They say that they're supposed to be healthy for your eyes. If they're not growing my lashes, they're not dropping them. So I'm really happy about that. Overall, I would rate this mascara 4.25. I like it. Uh, 4.25 into 4.5. I really like it comboed with other mascaras that give length. I really like it um, in terms of using it on, on its own. I give it a 4. But in combo with a mascara that gives length, the volume from this and that length really makes my mascaras, um, my lashes, sorry, look very nice, long, full. And I'm very comfortable with that look. For those who you who are curious about getting this mascara, I would recommend it. I say it's an everyday kind of mascara that you can use um, for daily use. This mascara will definitely be a repurchase. I know it's a little pricey, but I would repurchase. I actually really like it. So that's my take and my experience in using this mascara. Hope it was helpful for those of you. Again, like I said, you know, you saw it around once if it was okay. Should you invest in getting it? I say go for it. It's a nice everyday mascara, and you actually get. Um, seven milliliters of product here so it's a good amount for the price the other mascaras are a bit cheaper but you get seven mls with them so this in itself four other mls can give you maybe if that one was lasting a month or two this will take you actually into another month so thanks for watching until next time bye